Hello again, welcome to part 2 of Drunk on Nectar's Life as Prey Grasshopper Survival Series. This is Venu, the developer behind this game, and let's resume the life story of our little grasshopper friend. So here we are, fifth in star, at the onset of the sixth and the final one, and I have a grasshopper predator on me straight away. And that dragonfly got what he deserved. Dragonflies don't have gender in the game yet, uh, but their life cycle will eventually make it in and at that point we'll have to see. <laughs> That's going to be pretty interesting. Alright, my chemo receptors are overloaded, so it's time to groom. Let's get a good close look. Uh oh, someone's on to me. I think it's the jumping spider. Let's groom again, because I want to be able to see my predators clearly. Uh, I'm going to take a little risk here. Uh, that is just a bit too hard. I want to see if I could finish my grooming. Oh, he's not going to let me do it. Once again, the gender of the dragonfly remains a point in ambiguity, but we'll resolve it at some point. For now, I'm going to go back to grass. I think life on an orange lily is a bit too action-packed for my liking. So let's relax on grass instead. I have another friend here, slightly larger, but we are not too far behind either. Uh oh, jumping spider alert. Let's see, where to next? Let's try our luck on this one. sizzling of all those wings is indicative of the number of dragonflies around and there's quite a few and sure soon enough Let's see if I can jump straight onto this. Uh oh. This is where the game gets a lot more fun because I'm not big enough to start crushing predators, so they better watch out. Almost got him there. 
Let's see if I can leap onto this grass. That would be pretty fun. Oh yeah. Um. Aha. That may well be a knockout. We'll have to see. No. Two hits and you get a knockout on a dragonfly. And that's the second one. I believe that's a knockout. We'll have to see. No. I really want to show you a knockout, but we'll have to wait till we get a predator. That's foolish enough to come twice. Yeah, that should do it. Oh yeah, I vanquished him. That's our first knockout. So, it's a good idea not to underestimate these mighty legs. <laughs> they pack quite a punch. So, I personally really enjoy Grasshopper gameplay. I hope you do too. I think it's a nice balance of uh, not just being a prey who keeps running away all the time but a prey who also has some uh, <laughs> nice mighty legs to defend itself with. And there's another one. <laughs> I'm looking for a nice bit of grass to munch on. but. I think we'll have to settle for a plant instead. We're almost there. Almost an adult. At this point of the game, it seems like all the grass in this part of the town has been completely exhausted. So I'm going to try my luck here. Stamina is low. If you haven't seen the first part of this video already, do check that out. You get to see how our little grasshopper friend hatched from an egg, encountered a lot of predators, survived and made its way all the way up to here. Here at on the threshold of adulthood. We are going to find a mate soon, things are going to get pretty exciting, so stay with me. A bit more grooming to do and we're off on our way again. I haven't seen that many jumping spiders in this particular playthrough but the game is completely randomized so each playthrough is different. Personally for me every single time I've played the Grasshopper gameplay it's been drastically different from the other so I do encourage you to give it a try as many times as you'd like because each gameplay is going to be different. So far I haven't had a single game that's been quite like another. And you also have multiple generations to play through. I'm not sure if we are going to try that for this video series but we'll see how long it takes. We're almost there, almost an adult.
I'm going to turn the volume up because this is my favorite song in the game. It's a really special song for me. I hope you enjoy it too. It was made for the monarch butterfly and there's a lot behind it. And here we go. The bliss of a monarch. Not gonna let these dragonflies interrupt my victory dance. And this is the grasshopper song. It was made for the grasshopper and it is quite fitting. Because here we are. Finally an adult grasshopper. It is a song of joy and celebration and quite fitting too because now we have wings to soar all the way up into the skies through the glades of joy. Time to find a male to mate with and time to be drunk on nectar. There's a potential mate. Let's see if I can make my way up to him. And the shift in music indicates that we are going to have some unwanted company. Predators. Let's see if we can give them the slip and enjoy a little bit of grasshopper lovemaking. This is the final part of the courtship dance. And here we go. And just in time. Because there's a predator out there. The white trail indicates this is a grasshopper I've mated with, but let's see if we can find another one. The game wants me to deposit grass, but I'm going to find another male instead. Let's see here. It's a pretty crowded leaf, but let's see what we can manage here. Alright, the final part of the courtship dance. The male mounts us. And that's that. Alright, there was a brief interruption due to a power outage here, but we are back now. Let's see what we can do. We've made it twice so far. Um, Let's lay some eggs before we move on to other business. 
This is the freeform ovipositor. Let's try it back here. Find another plant. This OV position system was added to the game for the Monarch Butterfly and uh, now it's been added for the Grasshopper as well. It allows you to place eggs with millimeter level precision um, which doesn't sound like much until you actually zoom out and you realize just how tiny all of this really is. So being able to layer eggs which are so small with that kind of precision um, is pretty interesting. Um, I made a mistake of that. I should actually be laying my eggs here at the base of the stalk. Right now the game doesn't penalize you for it, but yeah, for the sake of correctness I'm going to... Yeah, and we're done. Alright, let's find just one more mate. Because I think it's fun and then, then we can move on. We haven't had much predator interaction um, yet. I want, let's see if we can get some predator interaction going here this time. And this time I'm going to go all the way from the other side. That is what I was expecting. Our wonderful courtship dance has been interrupted by a predator, by a dragonfly. And now I'm going to have to run and find my mate. <laughs> oh no, and the mate got caught by a dragonfly. Let's see if I can rescue uh, her or him. Wait a minute. I'm a female uh, grasshopper here. <laughs> Both of us got caught. I'm going to let you catch me and then I'm going to unleash my mighty legs onto both of you. Yeah, that felt quite good. Now to see if I can actually find uh, him. Once again, I'm a female grasshopper here. That's another dragonfly. It's got what it deserved. If I want to be mean, I can do a knockout, but I'm not going to do that. I think that wouldn't be nice. I'm only going to act in self-defense. But you can feel free to do what you like when you play. Here's another. We never completed our last courtship dance, so I want to make sure I get that one in. Victory parade among the milkweeds is quite fitting. Oops, let's try another one that doesn't ruin the moment. Alright, that's much better. And one of my favorite songs in the game, the Monarch's mating ritual song. Alright, this looks like a good spot. Maybe not. Let's find a better one. There are some locomotion issues out there. Um, they'll be fixed in due course, don't worry. Yeah, sounds better. Oh wait, I think I know what's going on. We'll just have to skip the fern for now. 
I want to find a nice surface. Yeah. I think this lap will do for now. Oh no. I'm feeling a little choosy. How about the underside of this? You know what, let's just... Um, let's conclude this gameplay here. I'm going to skip to the end of my life. Because I want to show you what the second generation gameplay looks like. So let's make sure we get that in as soon as possible. Alright, exhausted from your labor, if your final flight beckons, find a place to gently rest. And that is exactly what I'm going to do. I'm feeling a little partial towards milkweed today, so let's find a milkweed. Mm, maybe not that one. This one. Yeah, I'm not going to lie down on a half eaten leaf. See, what's the perfect milkweed? I like the look of you. Further ahead. Zoom out a bit. And the journey ends. But another begins. And a new life awaits you. As we zoom out into the vast expanse and we soak in the music, let's just sit back, relax, watch the clouds roll by, and let nature do its thing. And here we are, second generation. Here's a new cluster of eggs. And this time you're going to choose your gender. Last time we played as a female, so this time I'm going to choose a male. But which one is it going to be? The one. The space bar to incarnate. That's what I'm gonna do. And I'm just gonna take in the nice view by this phone. 